Hey, this is Rich from Boots and Jeans Riders. I was just coming out in the parking lot to practice in the Motorcycle Foundation course. And this young man came out, just got his license in December, and still out here practicing. This is what I'm talking about. This is how you get better. He's going to be a fantastic rider. He got the head and eyes thing down, everything. So I'm about to set up a new or set up something different for him to practice also. And I'll let him talk when I get a chance to get back to him. How's it guys going? This is Travis King. I'm out here trying to get a little practice in so I don't kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> what are you riding? Uh, Triumph Street Triple 2018. Check it out. This is what I mean about practicing every chance you get. Middle of the week, I was just running out here just to mess around in the parking lot. He actually came out with his own cones just to practice because he's always striving to get better. If you don't practice, you can have experience, but no skills. This man going to have some skills. <laughs> That's the goal. I'm going to show you what he set up. This guy got his own cones, and this is what he set up. The offset cone weave, just like you learn in basic school. And then over here, we have the just the regular cone weave so you can start dipping that bike in and out and over here we have another offset cone weave that's 24 by 30. what he's doing right now is doing his circles wide circles getting that lean he did this kind of balance a little bit more look where you want to go and going back out using the entire parking lot taking it to his advantage this is actually a parking lot that california's motorcycle safety program uses he was over here doing his emergency braking which i encourage everybody to do that's the most important skill you can learn is your emergency braking and now he's about to come down and do the msf con weave Doing fantastic. Look ahead. Don't look down. Don't look down. There we go. He missed one, but hey, that's why he's practicing. This guy is going to be well ahead of his time. He practices at least, at least three times a day. That was a nice U-turn. That was probably about a 27-foot U-turn. He's coming back again and going through his cone weave. I don't want to get in his way because I don't want him to stare at me. Looking good, looking good, looking real good. That's what it's about. Getting your practice on. I was just here to go in the parking lot and do some practice. I didn't have any cones. This man came in, bought some cones. Got his cones here. Got cones over there. Regular cone weave right here. And he's doing it. He's doing it good. We got an offset. Caught over here also. And also caught over here, way on the op other side, is 30 by 24, set off by 12 feet. Okay, this Rich, I'm about to wrap it up. A man still gonna stay out here practicing. He practicing a lot. He about to start doing his tight circles right now. And I unfortunately have to leave. I'm going to ride some back roads to get home. And this is what I'm talking about, about practicing. He tells me that he just got his license in December. 
and it's January right now and he's out here practicing he practicing everything he purchased a book from Moto Jitsu uh, the YouTube channel and he actually going through that book going through his belts right now and getting all this skill level down experience don't mean nothing without skills so he's getting the skill level down as you can see he doing this is a huge parking lot he done the offset cone weaves over here the big offset cone weaves on this side and he had a circle set up here and we had the regular cone weave set up here i didn't come out here to set up no cones i just came out here to, to look at the track and do some practicing but he came out here bought his own cones and this is great the guy is actually doing fantastic he gonna get his skills up so quickly it's gonna be unbelievable i try to encourage him to do a youtube channel hopefully he do his youtube channel so everybody can see his progress to show that with just a little practice daily you can get your skill level up high to where you have the confidence to ride on these roads without worrying about overriding your skill level and so then I'm Rich for Boats and Jeans Riders. Remember, ride long, ride hard, ride strong, and most importantly, ride safe. Peace.